Hello guys, today we're going to be doing another uh, Lord of SQL injection and the challenge that we're going to be doing today is going to be called Org. So with this challenge, it's very similar to one that we did previously, the one called org.py. Because as you see right here, it has the at slashes and if you see closely right here, it looks like we're going to have, we're gonna have to guess the password like always. So it's almost the ex exact same thing, but there seems to be one major difference from the previous challenge. This time it's filtering out or and and. So that's a major issue because usually what we'll do is just like, uh, cause to bypass this, well, and this is my query that I was using beforehand, but we're just gonna ignore that and see that never happened. We usually we do or then we set ID equals to admin and this will pass us through. So admin, and then we just uh, comment everything out. But then we get he he. Reason being is because or is being filtering out. But like we learned from the previous challenge that we did before, you could represent or in a different way. And one way to represent or is just by simply doing this, doing adding the two uh, the two tilde. So if we just do admin, then we just close it, and then we just do this. We see that or is represented somehow. So they're and they're not filtering out. Uh, the the I guess the two sticks it's only filtering out or the literal word or and and so that helps us bypass this so what we can do technically is reuse our old script that we did beforehand which was with orc so orc.py we could reuse this script reuse it and use it and uh, reuse it again so and that's what basically what I did for the most part all I did was just uh we used the script. I got my PHP session IDs by inspect element. I got the URL. After that, I passed it. In, I passed in the values that were needed to solve this challenge. Uh, that's weird how it came out like that. Okay, now it came out perfect. I passed this in. We see ID equals to admin and the ampersand sign. This is just guessing for the length of the password. And after that, it does all of this sends a request and then right here we just we're just guessing through only alphanumeric so only numeric and also uh uh alphabet values that's basically 48 to 122 we could probably could make it more but uh, i'm doubt they'll make it anymore and after that we just pass this in we url and you we url encode this we just add this simple and we just keep the exact same thing so it's basically the exact same thing as our scripts just has to do a little bit of modification the only modification was just adding this in and adding i guess this part in but same uh, for the most part the same thing we need the exact same techniques as we did last time so this this was a pretty fun challenge because it was going off i it was going off the ideas of our previous challenges so let's ls so what we'll do is just run python 3 i think it's org dot pi and we'll just see this run so we're just seeing this run for the most part we got guess password 8 so i'm guessing that was it was this one so i'll just copy this and we'll see that it passed through so we just copy this and you see it's brute forcing its way through it and we see it length of password is equal eight so i'm guessing that was true so i printed out hello admin so that means that this statement is true so the length of the password is eight and then after that I just trying every single value and we could see here the changes the or sign and then the, the and sign and then if we just grab one of these so i'm just gonna grab one of this one or this one we we'll grab that one and then we're gonna see it print out and say hello admin so at position three as size one at position three of the front of the password it looks like seven is part of it so that's checking it to be sure and right now it's finishing it up right now so it's size eight so we have one two three four five six we have six of them so far so this is still gonna take a while and oh it looks like we got it right here so like always, looks like we, we got this statement. So if we just simply pass this in as a password, it should be true. But it looks like it's not, which is pretty weird for the most part. But like, I guess looking over it, it looks like uh, SQL passes in certain values as like, as true. So like these, like the only reason these pass as true is because uh, uh I guess B and B are, could be represented like similar, I guess. I guess that's why. So I just had to turn these lowercase and this just solves the challenge for us. Yes, we get org clear. So yeah, 
that was pretty cool for this challenge for the most part it, it was basically going off what we were what, what we did in the previous two my sequel challenges pretty much just had to modify your script a bit and i'll be posting my scripts on github so you guys could be able to look at it and you guys be able to i guess look at the code and yep yeah, that was about it for this challenge anyway uh peace